global greetings to all my fellow refleites i am moksha i am moksha shukla from class 4th and today i am going to read out chapter 1 in a social studies book let's start 1 india our motherland india is a very big country the total land area of india is about 33 lakh square kilometers it is the seventh largest country in the world the countries which are larger in area than india are russia canada usa china brazil and australia the total population of india is more than 125 crores india location india is located in the southern part of asia india consists of the mainland and two groups of islands one in the arabian sea and the other in the bay of bengal india is surrounded by pakistan and afghanistan in the northwest china nepal and bhutan in the north and bangladesh and myanmar in the east sri lanka in the south is separated from india by park strait the latitudinal and longitudinal extent of india is about 30 degrees each the tropic of cancer passes through the middle of our country the north south extent of our country is about 3200 kilometers while the east west extent is about 2900 kilometers the land boundary of india is about 15200 kilometers long the coastal boundary of india including the island groups is about 7500 kilometer the sa- the southern part of india is a peninsula it is surrounded by the arabian sea in the west the indian ocean in the south and the bay of bengal in the east india is only country in the world after which an ocean indian ocean has been named the southernmost tip of the whole country is the indira point which is in the nicobar islands the southern tip of the indian mainland is in is kanyakumari in tamil nadu states and union territories india became an independent country on 15th august 1947 and a republic on 26 january 1950 the official name of our country is the republic of india today india is divided into 28 states and 8 union territories the states are marked on the basis of languages spoken by the people the union territories are under the control of the union government delhi is the capital of india the offices of the union government are in new delhi rajasthan is the largest state and goa is the smallest state in area uttar pradesh has the has the highest population and sikkim has the lowest Uttar Pradesh also has the largest number of districts. The seven states in northeast are called 
Seven Sisters The two groups of islands are Lakshadweep in the Arabian Sea and the Andaman and Nicobar Islands in the Bay of Bengal. Physical Features of India India is a big country and has a larger and has a large variety of landforms. The main types of landforms are mountains, hills, plains, plateaus, deserts, etc. The la these landforms vary from one place to another. India can be broadly divided into five physical divisions. Physical divisions are 1. Northern Mountains 2. Northern Plains 3. Western Desert 4. Southern Plateaus 5. Coastal Plains and the Island Groups we will study about these physical divisions and the people living and working in, the, in these divisions in the next few lessons. New terms to know. Continent, a very large landmass. Peninsula, a land area which is surrounded by the water on three sides. Strait, a narrow water body which separates two landmasses. Union Territory, the administrative unit controlled by the central government. Physical Features, the natural landforms found on the earth's surface. If you, so, if you like the video, please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Bye!